Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a tricky question that many developers encounter. Our viewer is generating a PDF in the browser using PDF Kit, but they're facing an issue with the default file name when downloading the PDF. The question is, how can you set the default save as name for an embed or iframe that uses a blob? Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you get through that resolution. So, let's continue on. To control the default save as name for a PDF generated in the browser, we need to understand how browsers handle blob URLs. When you create a blob URL, it doesn't inherently carry a file name. One effective approach is to create a download link that specifies the desired file name. You can achieve this by using an anchor tag with the download attribute. In this example, replace desired file name.pdf with the name you want the file to have when downloaded. This method works in most modern browsers. If you want to trigger the download programmatically, you can create a temporary anchor element in JavaScript, set its href to the blob URL, and programmatically click it. By following these steps, you can effectively control the default file name for your generated PDF when users download it, regardless of the browser they are using. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Unfortunately, you cannot directly control the default save name for files stored on a user's local file system. However, you can suggest a file name using an anchor element with a download attribute. Here's a simple JavaScript example. When the page loads, it creates a blob and generates a download link with a suggested file name. For Chrome and Chromium browsers, you can use Request File System to store blobs or files in the local file system, allowing more control over file storage. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. This answer discusses setting a default save name for a PDF displayed in an iframe or embed using a blob. It notes that the information is outdated and suggests checking other sources for better responses. The user found a method that works in Firefox, setting the file name to download.pdf in Chrome, but Chrome does not accept custom file names. To set the file name in Firefox, you can use a data URI format. However, Chrome does not support this feature. The user provides a code snippet that works in Firefox and a link to a Plunker example for Chrome. They also recommend using Mozilla's PDF.js for more control. For better control over PDF display, consider using Mozilla's PDF.js instead of relying on browser plugins.
And that's it guys. I hope this video helped find that resolution you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.